Our hearts beat to the city streets We begin to feel the fire We rise like tall buildings As the chemicals they take us higher The night's young and it's just begun As she puts her hand in mine We wanna chase the night Can you just do it for us? And so today, that is the day that we are going to make that recipe. Okay, so today is kind of windy, cloudy. I don't know. I don't know if you are. You can see me well, but I can see you well. So guys, let's do this. So today, I'm going to do a dry fry cabbage. So if you are among those people who don't like cabbage guys please don't hate cabbage okay i know there are so many you know what do we call them munasema cabbage inafanyia nini wanawake put that aside guys so today we are going to do the cabbage dry fry cabbage recipe so that is what somebody suggested for me and not just one person but a few people and I felt like why not why not so if you don't know my name on Facebook I go by the name K Catherine Zimbi not K Soli <laughs> so if you want to interact with me on our Facebook platform just go search Catherine Nzemi, all right? That is my official name, okay? And so guys, let, let us do this, okay? And we'll be happy because we are making this recipe and I know it will, you know, uh, give you a good vibe if you always have a bad vibe with cabbages. And so guys, you can see here, I have some ingredients that I want to show you so we may get started because you know when i start talking kate is just always talking so guys as you can see and um i was cutting the cabbage i'm not done with it so the first thing that we'll need is the cabbage and then we'll go by carrot then always when i'm cooking i must use a garlic and uh, red onion i don't know why people call this red onion but when i look at it it's purple in color so i don't know why anyway let's just leave it there so here i've got uh, i got coriander leaves and i got coriander stems okay so my tone today is high because somebody said kate your voice is too low you need something to upgrade yourself and i said no i got a good voice so let me do this okay as we try find something else okay where are we we are here soy sauce soy sauce this one will make our cabbage okay for a good test then we got uh cooking oil as a mask we should use and uh salt kamakawaida and then i got um curry powder here this is a seasoning um curry powder then i got my beef cube this ones are so good for making you 
know, your uh, vegetables are uh, really yummy, you know? Get that good taste. That bite. That's that mad thing you're making you not to eat. You eat. Okay, so what else do I have? I have here paprika and so guys. I think those are the only ingredients that I'm going to go with today. Just, just in case I had something else as we go on, but I don't know, I will um, inform you. So let's do, let's do this. Finish up our cabbage cutting. Then we go to the kitchen. I'm still in the kitchen. I don't know why I'm staying. I'm, I'm saying we go to the kitchen because this is an open kitchen. So I'm still in the kitchen. <laughs> okay. Tuende kwa jiko jiko yenyewe. What am I saying? Kwa stove. Okay. Let's do this. Okay. So guys, we have come to the favorite part that everybody is waiting and so guys what we're gonna start with is lighting our heat then put the pan okay you can wait your pan to get hot or you can as well put your cooking oil and wait for it to get hot okay so just put your cooking oil in a way that is not too much and not too little so there we are and we have to wait we have to wait for our cooking oil to get hot okay that is where we are and so because today we are making dried fried cabbage i want you to understand that uh when i'm saying we are making dry fried cabbage i don't know how you understand but this is what to me i'm going to explain to you so when we are making dry fried cabbage what i'm not going i'm not going to use is water and i'm not going to use tomato tomatoes no, neither am I going to use tomato paste. It's just like that. Actually, if there's something which is liquid here, it's just cooking oil. So nothing else, okay? And to that point, we are waiting our cooking oil to get hot. So we may put our garlic as well, put our red onion. Okay, our cooking oil is hot. So the first thing is garlic. Let's go with the garlic. Good job. It's smelling so good. Not tested yet. <laughs> At this point, you can put your heat to be high if you want to make everything high quick. Then we put our red onion. There we are. Delicious. 
so at this point I'm going to add my seasoning got this pepper and I'm gonna start with it actually I'm done with it <laughs> as if it was waiting for me we do this one then it's normal so this is beef cube to make our cabbage yum yum because you don't want to eat something that is not yum yum okay let's put it there stick it let me hide my curry powder one teaspoon is enough one teaspoon is enough two kilos and one paprika here I was checking my spices and it's like I'm um, finished with spices so I have to go shopping but this darn did prevent me to do this uh, recipe of today because it was a suggestion so when it comes to spices you can actually choose your spices because you know there are people who don't want who don't like spices so people are different but I'm doing as to how you can do with or without spices not a must okay without spices you can do coriander you can do coriander you can do onion you can do with garlic that's so cool that's so good nothing bad with that okay to that point i'm gonna add my salt So remember my heat is is too high for me to make my uh, cabbage uh, the way I want to do it so in, I'll have to make a little low we are steaming okay we are cooking our cabbage through steam Is it through steam or by steam? Okay, so our heat is low now. So it's had our cabbage. Job. Okay, I think everyone likes vegetables. Let me append the vegetables. Everybody, okay? You should because if you don't eat vegetables, your tummy will be um too hard for you anyway. So to funike, let's cover our cabbage, then I show you what we are going to do. So we are going to give it like 10 minutes, then we come back add whatever we are going to have because this is gonna take a little time because he ayarakishwi inapelea kwa tu pole pole okay so there we are and we have done it good so it's not something that is difficult to do you can do aka kama ujui kupika there are people who are like Kate I don't like I don't love cooking but guys Utaishi aje bila chakula. So guys, wacha tungoje. At this point, guys, let's see what's happening here. Um, it's the time now we should add our carrots to give us a good color as well. 
And because carrot is a good vegetable as well, we need it eat each and every time, okay? So to create to see to vegetables, alright? To see to vegetables. We should eat vegetable vegetables. Kabisa sana. So at this point, I'm gonna create um you see cabbage as water. So don't always put water. So here. Here we have. We give it time to cook. No adding anything. So we come up and mix it. everything you get that good color okay so guys at this point I'm going to add my cooking oil a little bit so but if for you so if you don't like too much cooking oil please don't don't if you don't like okay i'm gonna use soy sauce this this is optional it's not a must, must use it just use what you have okay so you can you you can cook ordinary or just cook like cakes you know so a little bit of soy sauce okay so we mix up everything But I, I'm going to give it five minutes, then I call it a day. So at that point, you can see this. This is so yummy. You can take with rice. You can take with uh, with garlic, sima. If you don't like, you know, mixing with um stew, like you can uh, cook you 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 use your stew aside and um take it with this so five minutes this gives our set ourself five minutes so here we are we are doing as you can see so let's add our coriander leaves
you can see no water no nothing all cooked looking so good so we put we put off the heat and we are done food for serving now okay so guys we have reached the end of this video today and so guys look at my cabbage look at my cabbage the way it looks steamed cabbage you can say dry fried as well it is the way you want it okay so guys before we go or before i go make sure that you hit the subscribe button and no wait do you know the importance of cabbage do you know okay let me give you three importance of cabbage so when you don't like the cabbage you know what you are you marrying your body okay what you are marrying your body is this cabbage is rich in fiber okay cabbage is rich in fiber and uh, rich in vitamin C and rich in vitamin K. So guys, he usihate in yako. Even me, there's a time I wasn't cooking or eating cabbage because of some reasons here and there. But when I got into Google and searched everything, I understood what it means to have a cabbage in your body. So guys, let me see you on the next video, guys. For today is a bye bye.